Hershey's have been the talk of the town for a while now. Ever since they were announced on January 27th, it's been nothing short of controversial. I mean, who in their right mind would spend this much on a plushie when you can spend the same amount of money and go buy your grandma's car? No, don't look at me like that. <laughs> Everyone was on Twitter boycotting purchasing any and urging others to do so as well. I mean, would you rather have this plushie or a rent for an entire month at this place? Okay, maybe that's not so great. It became pretty apparent pretty quickly who these plushies were actually meant for. YouTubers. YouTubers spend stupid money to make videos and then business expense it and get a tax write-off. If that's the case though, why did hardly any YouTubers get them? Russo, the king of pay to win, didn't get one. The second highest spender on Pet Sim, Gravy Catman, didn't get one. Razorfish made a video saying he was the only YouTuber to get some, yet numerous also seem to get one, so I guess numerous isn't a YouTuber? I don't know. And then LCLC sent me this meme right here of him getting six. Guys, I think LCLC stole all the children's Titanic plushies. How the heck do you get six? They all of it like sold out in seven minutes. I mean, Preston did say that there was a very limited quantity and there were less plushies than people who dislike my videos. Well, uh, you should hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. But the real question is, how did I, the one-armed bandit, fare? Well, uh, this is how it went. It all started Saturday morning, about a half hour before the plushie drop. I knew this was going to be hard to get as scalpers and YouTubers would be trying their hardest to get every plushie available. I was in it for the little guy. All those kids who desperately asked their parents for one and then were unsurprisingly told no, laughed at even. This is what happened. We've got a mission. We're gonna save the children from childhood gambling, taking all the plushies and giving them out to the world. Regular Robin's Hood we will be. I need your help. Okay. Are you ready? If this isn't gonna work, I only have one. Break. I'm gonna be on this and on this and my phone. Baby Vox is gonna be on this computer and the iPad. We're gonna buy two each because that's all they will allow at one time. Are you ready for this? Uh, I don't know how this works. Okay. Oh God. <laughs> All right, 11.59. We'll have to refresh here too. It's on, it's on, add the cart, add the cart. Oh God, oh God, shop now, sick merch. Come on, come on, add the cart. Go, 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 go. You can only add one of each. What? How do I go back to my cart? Go to the cart, check it out. Wait, what did you do? I just checked out. Add the cart. I did. One and one, check out. Do it on this. You only did one? I don't know. I said one of each. I'm in line here. I'm in line here. I'm in line here. Okay, okay, okay. And I'm also gonna do it on my phone. One, add the cart. I'm in line to check out on all three things. And then Baby Fox in line to check out. Okay, first part is over. Now we just have to wait. And wait, we did for five minutes. Five devices all checking out within 30 seconds of the drop happening. I was feeling confident. Then the unthinkable happened. Okay, okay, okay. This one's working. This one's working. It just updated again. Oh my God. Oh my God. Now it's waiting six minutes again. No, one of them sold out. No! Oh, this one sold out too. Oh my God. Everything's just waiting and waiting and waiting. But waiting wasn't something we had to do much longer as only seven minutes in, everything was gone. Sold out, sold out, sold out. Everything is sold out. That was it. All the plushies were gone. Seven minutes of pure heck trying to get one device to check out. Only to see my cart get to the checkout and then thrown back in line again. I was without a Titanic plushie. This meme right here really puts into perspective how I was feeling. Yet it's worse because I didn't actually get the t-shirt. I was left with nothing. This is a load of barnacles. Okay, fine. It's time I come clean. I might not have been successful getting bitty plushies, but my daughter... I put play now. What? Yes, pay now. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, baby box, you did it! Yeah, she was. One Titanic plushie of each kind. You see, what happened is the plushies actually dropped 30 seconds early and people took full advantage of it. I just so happened to refresh and saw it was live early and added the carts to the item on my laptop before moving on to everything else. This basically meant that if you didn't see the site go live early, you missed your chance to get one as within literally 30 to 45 seconds of all the plushies being released, they were all in a cart waiting to be checked out. That's why so many people ended up missing out. But hey, who's the real winner here? Me, the guy who spent more money on a plushie, or you who now can take that money and go buy a Nintendo Switch, an Xbox mini fridge, even a flat screen TV? Man, that's a Friday night gaming session for the next 20 years. I will say though, I really enjoyed the memes that have come through this. I asked people on Twitter to give me some Titanic plushie incident memes, and well, you guys didn't really disappoint. This is how most people felt. I was online for the Titanic plushie and <laughs> I got was this t-shirt. I should legit sell that. Here's LCLC making fun of me. Wait, did he get seven? The big game's website during the drop. Just Titanic sinking. We have the private jet. Not many people have that. A yacht, even less people have that. A private island, even less people have that. And the Titanic balloon plushies. So many people. <laughs> Leave the 
richest of the rich have that. Oh, you have an island? I have a Titanic plushie. That's what I'm gonna say the next time I see Elon Musk. Buy a $249 new Apple Watch to help track, I don't know, your fitness, your lifestyle, your health, helps you be on time so you can actually go to a job and not get fired for being late? Nah, Titanic plushie. <laughs> what if you wanted a Titanic balloon plush, but God said, no, they're sold out. Choose wisely. Life support for $250 or Titanic balloon plushie. It's rough, man. Rough stuff. Every clickbait YouTuber be like, oh my God, I got a green Titanic balloon plush. This is totally legit. Not fake. You know, I could actually, when I get one, spray paint it and then say it's green and then upload an amazing video that's clickbait saying, oh, I got a limited edition green one. <laughs> that's not a bad idea. Boy, mom, can I have a Titanic plushie? Mom, we have the Titanic plushie at home. The Titanic plushie at home is not the same one. There's this like knockoff Titanic plushie going around apparently. Guys, don't fall for it. If it has a nose and not the button nose, like the end of a balloon, it ain't real. Here's just a Titanic plushie, probably cheaper too. You're not wrong. <laughs> it's probably cooler too as well. Here's how most people felt. Wow, Titanic plushies. God, man, I don't have any money. God, man, I'm a kid without a job, trying to go to school. I try to make money. My mom takes my money. How am I gonna buy a plushie? That was my life. You think you bought a Titanic plushie, but actually you just didn't have your glasses on and what you really bought was this. <laughs> See, look at the difference. Pet Sim X YouTubers coughing at the Beats headphones, which I uh, got some of, but they're just sitting in a box not being used. Nintendo Switch, iPhone 14s, which I think those are probably like maybe the SE versions because the iPhone 14s actually do cost a lot more unless you want to buy a plan with it. That's kind of a little shady trick the phone companies use, but we don't need any of that. They can't make us money. I will say though, I'm going to get a lot more views saying I bought Titanic plushies than saying I bought a Nintendo switch just why our face looks like this despite the ungodly amount Preston wants for them we make our money back I mean that's all there is to it I might spend a lot of money but I get a lot of money in return it was going to be my first Titanic oh me before the plushies first in line me after the Titanic plushies came out oh poor guy man me after trying to get a Titanic that's exactly how I felt big games be like why do you hate me <laughs> you aren't good enough I can make more money by making you bigger. Stay tuned for next year when we have life-size plushies for $5,000. <laughs> Intense decision. Nah, nah. Donating food to the poor, helping people get off the streets. Psh, that don't make me money. It's so bad that YouTube has become this weird thing where everybody's like flexing how many big things they can buy. I, I hate it, man. I hate it. I wish it wasn't the case. Look, <laughs> Charlie, you must face it. It's been an hour. The balloon is gone, man. Poor cat. Let's all, let's all just hit that like button for the cat. I got a time Titanic plush and I'm giving it away. Let's see it. Sold out in seven minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I got one and I'm giving it away when I reach 100,000 subscribers. How much subscribers does this guy have? 223. <laughs> Might be a minute. <laughs> Me saving up for a PC. Pet Sim X. Did you forget something? This one hits hard. Pet Simulator X YouTubers finally accepting spending 100,000 Robux per video just to get a huge. I didn't like doing it, but it kind of just became a thing. Once I started doing it and got into competition, everybody else piled on and then it just it's got so much worse. And then Preston came in. <laughs> Pet Simulator X YouTuber getting a Titanic after spending 10 million Robux and selling their house. Them knowing dang well that they're going to have to do it again for the next 10. <laughs> Every time he adds more Titanics to it, I just die a little bit more inside. Preston adding Titanics, underage gaming link with no value or real benefit. They're the same picture. What's crazy, it's not even underage gambling anymore. Most of the people going for these Titanics Titanics are actually grown adults. There's so many grown adults playing Pet Simulator these days, and they're all just wasting their money away. What, Timmy? You need new clothes. You need food for school. Look at this Titanic plushie I just got. Right here. Bro bought so many plushies that he couldn't pay for healthcare. <laughs> okay, it's time to come clean. I, all this stuff I just found laying around my house. I, I My arm's still broken. I didn't actually get surgery. I kind of just like gave myself some band-aids and called it good. Players, Titanic pets. Huge <laughs> pets. It's hardcore pets. Yeah, it's so weird, man. I remember when everybody wanted to get huge pets. Like, I get huge pets now, and I don't even feel the satisfaction that I felt before. Because there's always this over-looming thing of, hey, you don't have a Titanic. What's the fuss about all this? It's just a Titanic. Plush.
Me after becoming obsessed with Pet Simulator X. Homeless, but I got that Titanic plushie. What I wanted, what I got. <laughs> Darkness, loneliness, despair. Society if the Titanic balloon plushies were not added to Pet Simulator This is pretty much me. PSX YouTubers trying to get a Titanic plushie. <laughs> I don't know if he was happy or sad at the end. <laughs> Power Max was here, dude. Power Max, did you steal all the plushies? Did he even get any plushies? Well, it wasn't me who bought them this time. I only got two of each. Two of each? He got four? Power Max was here. Show me luxury. I said, show me luxury. <laughs> Perfection. <laughs> that one YouTuber buying 50 plushies. Actually, no, not this time. So the one person who said stupid, I couldn't kid him because of the rich YouTubers, Night Fox and Russo. Yeah, that it wasn't us. <laughs> it was not us at all. Jokes aside, the main reason I wanted to buy so many of them was to prevent the scalpers from taking all of them and then selling them for an even higher ungodly price. This time, however, yeah, I failed. And shortly after all the plushies were sold out, sites like eBay started seeing this, where plushies were being sold for triple the price or even more. And the worst part, people were so desperate that, you know, they went ahead and bought them anyway at the scalp price. You know what scalpers are? Five days ago, me said it best. Freaking vultures. <laughs> I failed. I failed you, game. I, I was trying to save the children and spend all my money so that they didn't have to. But now I've only got like one each for myself. And you know, I always said I was going to keep one for myself and then give all the others away. But then I didn't get any others. And I don't know. Part of me wants to still give it away because I feel like I still owe people. But at the same time, I also did want some myself. And so now I'm in this weird dilemma. You know, I just, I feel like I failed. I don't know what I could expect. I'm down to one arm. I was having somebody help me who'd never bought any plushies. I mean, we had five devices. And everything hit the carts they just kept refreshing for whatever reason like i had three times i was in the checkout part and it had me verify my phone number and as soon as i had to verify my phone number everything updated again it, it just i don't know maybe that's on me maybe that's my fault i tried to be prepared but uh yeah it is what it is i guess we'll just see when i get them and so here we are <sighs> the day has arrived that we get the balloon plushies no harold it won't replace you for those that don't know and are new this is harold back when the original huge balloon pet were released and you had to spend an ungodly amount of robux to get them i bought harold here to act as the quote unquote plush and here we are a few months later actually getting them also never give guy with one arm a knife they're extra dangerous Ooh, i didn't think about that hopefully that didn't pop the balloon stupid tape it's very hard to do an unboxing video <laughs> it's so big oh my god look at this <laughs> big. Look, Harold, it's just the size of you. And then there's the other one in here. It's this one. <laughs> one Titanic each. Oh my gosh. Hey, Box, this is what you want. You like it? I'm no, wait, wait, wait. I need one thing. One thing. Okay, go ahead. Goodbye. <laughs> what? No, 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 no. Harold needs a friend. Hello, Harold 2. All right, now the only thing we need to do is hop in the game and redeem these right here. All right, I'm in game. I got some codes. Let's um, redeem. Oh, it's a uh, sub to Night Fox. Redeem. Would you like to redeem this code? Yes, I would. There it is. Oh my God. Oh my God. I love the Titanic opening. It's so oh my God. It's so big. Oh, that was so fun, dude. Okay, let's do it again. <laughs> You star code knife fox. No space. All this one word. When buying Robux. Deem. Let's do it. Here we go. Give me shiny. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, let's click on it. Let's click on it. It never does anything, but we're going to try. We're just going to see. Does the clicking give you an extra luck? Give you a better one? No, I knew it wouldn't. It was just all fake. We're at 16 to 29. I'm only missing three. Technically two because of the comet agony thing. But Nick said he had something for me. You should be like number 25 soon. <gasps> what? <laughs> That's the huge comet cyclops. Okay, okay, okay. All right, let's trade. All right, these two for that one. Best deal. Can't clap, but best deal. Astra. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. These three for that one. We all index, which means I have 1630. I dare somebody to find a higher index than I have. You probably won't, unless somebody magically found both the huge comet pets. Only 64 exist. So Nick and I are going to go on a quest to find that last huge pet. And in the meantime, for everybody who made it to the end of the video, you see these two huge Titanics. We, we figured it out. We got it. But a lot of people missed out on it. And well, I hate having these. It feels kind of wrong 
going to almost because so many people wanted it and then we're just unable to get it. I mean, in the grand scheme of things, I'm number 25 on the leaderboard. Nope. God, dude, it goes down so much. I barely played this game for like three days and I've gone from number 10 to number 35. <laughs> Yo, maybe I should keep it, but no, I'm going to keep them for like maybe a month or so and then I'm actually going to give each one of them away. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned for the giveaway announcement in the future and thanks for watching everybody. Oh, also, I did get my t-shirt. However, it's got some weird lettering on it. I don't know what that means. Everybody's walking.